What's up model babes? Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you're new here, my name is Key and I help you new and aspiring models learn how to get started in the industry and really learn how to start making money doing it. So if that's what you're interested in, please make sure that you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so you know when I've uploaded videos. So in today's video, I wanted to share with you guys how I plan my content shoots, how I plan the batch shooting that I do to get content for my Instagram and just for anything that I need to use um, on social media. So that's what we're going to be doing today. I'm going to show you guys how I plan out my outfits to get content for social media when I do batch shooting days. And I've already showed you guys before how I do my batch shooting. I, I took you behind the scenes on a few model vlogs on how I do my batch shooting when I go out and actually shoot. But I wanna show you a little bit of the prepping process, the planning process of actually putting those shoots together. I have a shoot that I have scheduled for tomorrow to bang out like four to five different looks and I'm gonna show you guys everything I got. So, so I actually have this like big box of clothes that I got from Amazon Prime. And I'm gonna explain a little bit more about um, Amazon Prime and their special features where you can like try clothes for free. Yes, for free, honey. But yeah, I got this box in the mail um, a few days ago and I already went through the looks that I've gotten already and kind of pieced some looks together. So I'm just gonna show you guys exactly like what I'm going to be putting together and give you guys a little taste of what the photo shoot is going to look like. So yeah, that is what we're gonna be doing today. I hope you guys like this one. So I'm just gonna jump right into the first look that I have planned for tomorrow. Okay, so first up, I had found a dark wash denim pants jumpsuit, and I had just paired it with my silver boots that I bought a while ago. I've been had these boots, and I've showed them in previous videos, because I thought it would give like, add a little something to this like basic look since it was just like a plain jumpsuit. But after looking back at the video, I decided I did not like how that looked. So I decided to switch shoes and just use my old reliable black heels that I have and I thought it was nice and simple. So just to give a little backstory, my agency had told me I needed a little bit more lifestyle photos, a little bit more smiles in my portfolio so they can push me because the market that I'm in in Vegas is very, you know, more commercial and lifestyle. And um, so is LA, which is where I'm trying to get more work into. So I had to change up, you know, my portfolio a little bit. So that's why I got these outfits to just get a little bit more on the casual side of um of my looks so that's why next i have this really nice and simple red dress a long maxi dress and then i paired it with some white sneakers classic um i believe these were tommy hilfiger but all the items that you see me wearing will be listed in the description you can also find it on my website at keyalexander.com and going over to the model key favorites tab all of the items that i ever recommend to you guys in one of my videos beauty wise clothing wise etc if i can find it i link it for you over there and next up i found this really cute yellow dress it was like you know summertime when i was doing this so it was a really cute dress that I thought was happy and fun and smiley and said all the good, you know, lifestyle things that I should be having in my portfolio. So I got that. And then I just paired it with these chunky sandals. Um, the sandals were a hit or miss, you know, like when I was looking at them on Amazon, I wasn't sure if I was going to like them. And looking back at it, I really didn't like how it came out. You can always check out the photos on my Instagram at that's so key but yeah the shoes were just a little too chunky for me I think I would have liked it with a different outfit a little bit more but I was really trying to be outside of the box and just try something different because I know like these chunky sandals chunky boots is kind of a trend so I wanted to see what it looked like and the pictures aren't that bad so you guys head over to my Instagram and check out the photos and you let me know does the look work or not continuing on with like the lifestyle casual look I found a denim shirt on Amazon and I already had some light wash jeans that I paired it with and then I took those same 
white shoes that you saw me pair with the red dress and use them for this look as well so that's the great thing about using Amazon Prime wardrobe is like you can get all these looks and for free try them out first before you want to buy them or just use them how I use them get them and you know take some pictures and send them back so if you head over to Amazon and log in and if you go over to where it says accounts and lists you can go down to memberships and subscriptions so prime wardrobe is actually a subscription so you actually have to pay monthly to try it out but it's only $4.99 so $4.99 a month five bucks to try out like eight products a month and you don't even have to pay for them you can send them back so I think worth it especially for a model or an influencer who's really trying to build up their content on Instagram I definitely think that Amazon Prime Wardrobe um, having that personal shopper feature added to your account is really going to be helpful when you click into personal shopper you can see and you can just search up here too as well personal shopper and it'll come up but I already have it so when you go to personal shopper you can see that um, you have a little area over here where you can like rate clothes so Amazon is going to you know pair you up with a shopper per se like a stylist um, that's gonna offer you you know items every month you don't have to use what you don't have to get what they uh, offer and if it has the try before you buy feature underneath where you're supposed to pay then you can just add it to your cart and that'll be added to the box um, and you get eight I believe items every month that you can try out so over here you can all um, say yes or no if you like it or not do a little um, rating and see if you know you want to just go with the stylist recommendation they can get a better idea of what you like um, but yeah you can just add stuff here that you want so for example if you want like you know some black shoes black heels that like every woman needs um, or if you're looking for like a if you're trying to do like a sporty look and want like just plain simple black shoes you can go down and where it says or over here it does not have a try before you buy so this isn't available but look you see right here where it says prime try before you buy so if you click that I've already added like a few items that I'm thinking of testing out for a new shoe but um but yeah all of these items here you're able to shop from and try on so they have like dresses tops pants they have categories like specifically for whatever you're trying to um, find or again you can just go with the personal shopper so like again if you're just trying to do some shoes some black heels or something like that look how, how much like these shoes cost 85 120 80 60 like all of this is available to you for under five dollars a month like that's insane to me you know you could just wear it and um, send it back if you don't like it you know or if you just want to try something else which I think is amazing you have a week before you have to send it back so Amazon gives you a full seven days from when your shipment arrives to your door they know when it gets to you so you have seven days to try everything out take your pictures you know get your looks in and then you have to send it up pack it back up and return it back to Amazon within that seven day window if you don't they will charge your card for however much all the items cost but you can always do a return and just return the items like a regular Amazon return and then you'll get refunded your money so either way it's a win-win situation but you do have like a seven day window where you're not charged where you can just try these items out and see if you like them and get your pictures in if that's what you want to do and then send the items back so yeah it's a really good way for influencers and models to really stock up on content and try out some new looks or if you're just trying to figure out like a new style for you that's what I originally got it for because I wanted to like 
figure out my style and really like hone in on what I wanted to wear and just try some things out. And so I thought this would be the perfect way for me to do that. So yeah, that is Amazon Prime wardrobe. And I wasn't done with this denim shirt. I thought that there was more that I could do with it. So I actually decided to pair it with some jean shorts that I had, some a little bit darker wash um, from the shirt, jean shorts. And then I switched the shoes from the white shoes to my nude heels. So I already had these nude heels that I paired it with. And these were different sunglasses that I had also um, picked out to wear because I thought they looked good. So yeah, I used these round sunglasses to go with the denim look, um, changed it up to the shorts and added some heels. And I thought I just took it up a notch, you know, just having a little bit, like the first look with the jeans was kind of like casual and you know laid back but this one is a little bit more like on the go like more like a fashion model like streetwear type feel for me so i thought this was a really cute look next i went with something a little bit more upscale following with the heels that i had on i decided to put that red dress back on and i just shortened it so it had like it was like a stretchy material like most maxi dresses are and i'm not sure what this one was actually made out of but i was able to like roll it up and it seamlessly became a shorter dress so i just folded the bottom half you know in half and brought it up to like mid thigh so it just become like a little bit shorter and then i paired it with a zach posen purse that i already had um, that i was gifted and it went perfectly with my new shoes so this was um a big win for me just to be able to use all of these different looks in multiple ways and get as much content as I could you know so it really makes me happy <laughs> And that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it valuable. And I hope you learned a few new tricks about how to plan your shoots in the future. Make sure you look out for part two of this video on how I plan out my actual inspiration board for my photo shoots and just plan out like the poses that I'm gonna be using, the locations that I'm gonna be looking for, and all of that, how I actually put it together before I head out to go shoot. So that's gonna be in part two of this video. So that's gonna be the next video. So make sure that you're subscribed to this channel so you know when that video comes out. And yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions, please make sure you leave a question down in the comments below. And I always answer all my questions. And if you're interested in trying out Prime Wardrobe for yourself, please make sure you let me know. Tag me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram at That's So Key, and let me know if you give it a try and if you find anything that you like. I really like it personally for myself just to try out different looks, just to figure out what my personal style is, and just to see you know what I could wear for myself, but also put together for shoots and just in general get content when I really need it and not have to pay. So it's a really great feature that Amazon offers and I really definitely recommend that you check it out um and that's all for this one i'll see you in the next one bye